Hey friends, a lot of users have been asking what is the CTF mon.exe process or the CTF loader process. What if uh, it is not starting automatically on the system? What if it is causing high CPU usage, etc. So I will explain everything. Now the CTF mon.exe process is a necessary process for the system which manages handwriting and uh, a few languages. It also manages emojis on the system. So uh, this is very important. Okay, anything other than the usual Roman script on the system will usually be managed by this. So it helps for managing languages like Japanese and Mandarin okay it also helps with the uh, symbols many symbols many emojis and all so it's a very important process now uh people keep asking that is it a virus or not most probably it's not a virus okay but uh, here's what cyber criminals do they disguise genuine processes as viruses on the system and uh, to isolate this case search for windows security in the window search bar and open windows security go to the virus and threat protection tab on the list on the left hand side select scan options select full scan and then click on scan now okay this should be very helpful and uh, if uh, you this process is not starting automatically then here's what you can do open the registry editor search for registry editor in the window search bar and open the registry editor window go to this process hkey local machine software microsoft windows current version and run in the right pane right click in the open space select new diva 32 bit value and name it ctf mon and then hit enter okay and then give it this value which is the path of the ctf mon.exe process in the c drive i will mention it in the description section of the video so double click on it and give it this process name okay and then hit enter okay we have to make it a new string value not a ctf mod, uh, not a divert 32 bit entry right click new string value and then right click and rename it name it uh, ctf mon double click on it double click on this change the value data and then click on okay was this helpful if yes then please subscribe to the channel and if not then let us know in the comment section of the video on how we could help you further thank you for watching this video and have a nice day